That's looped into right field coming in quickly Sanchez diving he can't make the catch. In the score comes Conforto on the third goes Baez a bloop single for VR to drive in a run and it's two nothing New York. Sanchez got a bit of a late break on that ball he could not make up as much ground as Sierra did on his play earlier in the inning and he came up a little short. He had it and it popped out. He made the catch and it just popped out of his glove. Mm. 29th of 2019. Grounded down to third. Alvarez boots it. Oh boy. That'll bring in another run. It's been a rough day for Alvarez. He made a throwing. And pitch number eight is hit a ton out to right. Oh, into the upper deck for Lewin Diaz. A big two run shot, and it gets the Marlins right back in the game. Now, once again, much like his at bat that we showed you in Tampa. Gaining momentum as this at bat goes on had seen the entire arsenal the cutter the splitter the cutter again a sinker and well he got a hanging splitter on the eighth pitch of this at bat and he goes upper tank. And that's driven to deep left field forget that Lindor started this game with an RBI single and gives the Mets insurance with a two run homer. 19th home run of the year for Lindor. His second in two games. And now the Mets have some breathing room. It's 5 to 2 New York. Just his fifth home run as a right hand batter. And there was no doubt about it. 1 2 coming. He struck him out. And the ball game is over. A 1 2 3 7 for Diaz. He saves it for Marcus Stroman. Francisco Lindor homeward and drove in three and the Mets snap a five game losing streak as they take the opener of the doubleheader from the Marlins five to two. Well Lindor the story as well as Stroman Lindor uh, two for four as Gary mentioned his 19th home run drove in three of the five Met runs three uh, Miami airs one unearned run for the Mets Stroman double digits 10 13 now in the year.